I've done something wrong, haven't I? I was wondering why those two guys are in jail since this morning while their lawyer is out here playing with a ball. We need to practice. It's not funny. It's a little funny. Lieutenant, would you feel very insulted if I recommended to your supervisor that he assign different counsel? Why? I'm not sure how to say this without possibly hurting your feelings, but I really don't think you're fit to handle the defense. You don't even know me. Ordinarily, it takes somebody hours to discover I'm not fit to handle the defense. Oh, come on. That was damn funny. My feeling is that if this case is handled in that same fast food, slick ass, Persian bizarre manner with which you seem to handle everything else, something's gonna get missed. Wow. I'm sexually aroused, Commander. I don't think your clients murdered anybody. The doctor's report says that Santiago died of asphyxiation, brought on by acute lactic acidosis, and that the nature of the acidosis strongly suggests poison. I don't know what any of that means, but it sounds pretty bad. Santiago died at 1 a.m., and at 3, the doctor wasn't able to determine the cause of death. Three hours later, he said it was poisoning. Now I see what you're saying. It had to be Professor Plum in the library with the candlestick. Yeah, I'm going to talk to your supervisor. Go ahead. Go straight up Pennsylvania Avenue. It's the big White House with pillars in front. Thank you. I don't think you'll have much luck, though. I was assigned by division, remember? Somebody over there thinks I'm a pretty good lawyer, so... So, while I appreciate the interest and admire the enthusiasm, I think I could handle things by myself. But Jessica's a great girl, and, and I know I've said this before, and maybe this is a problem I have, but I think she's great for someone else. I just don't see being with her for the long haul. <laughs> and I hate when I do that shit. When I start visualizing the future instead of simply living in the now. You know, just the now is all I should be focused on. But I'm a mind drifter, man. I have too big of an imagination. I start fantasizing about kids, a house, families. All that shit. I can't do it. Not this one. She's just not lining up with what I see. I'm starting to think it's me. I just can't seem to make it work. And I hate all this judging I do. I get confused and overwhelmed. All while I'm with her, my mind spins while she's sitting next to me telling me she loves me. What am I supposed to do? I'm breaking up with her. This Saturday, I'm doing it. I'll add her to the collection of amazing women I've been with. It's me. I need some time on my own. 